the tears. I might not need to narrate. Well, we got a Mazda 626, a Mazda 626, and a Mazda 62 piece of shit. <laughs> They're all these six pieces of shit. You're that wrong. Over there's a four cylinder. It's a piece of shit. This one runs. That one runs these transmission. That one's a piece of shit. Like I said before, this is a great car. That's a great car. And that's a piece of shit. <laughs> but they're all Mazdas. I would not own one. Right. Stick to your Honda. Piece of shit. <laughs> Stick to your Honda. Well, they all three had different problems. It all started months ago when he got this one. Because this one came in, it wouldn't start. It wasn't getting sparked. And it, it would turn over, but it wouldn't fire. We did the ignition coils. We did... Uh, we checked the computer in it, did the ignition coils. This one was also a V6 car. But it wouldn't run for shit. It just did not want to go. Well, took it, we gave up on it, took it to a dealership. As it turns out, the ignition switch was bad. So... Here's you more than likely what's wrong. If you've got the V6 and your ignition coil is good and your computer is good and it still won't get smart, spark, nine times out of ten, your ignition switch has gone bad. Throw a new ignition in it, it should fire right off. Because with the bad ignition, the gauge lights will still come on. Uh, most of the time, you can still hear, still hear the fuel pump prime, it just will not start. It's acting like it will not get sparked. Well, once again, your ignition switch is bad. The V6 cars are pretty good, and the, if you have a transmission go out in the V6 car, it's actually cheaper to get a V6 transmission than it is a four-cylinder. Like, what happened with this one? A four-cylinder automatic car, also a Mazda, 626, but this was a four-cylinder. Drove it, and see, it just wouldn't drive anymore. I can't even remember how many miles are on this one. 200, 212,000 miles on this one. And it actually still drives, it's just squirting out transmission fluid. Now, we actually don't think that the transmission is bad in this car. We think that it's something else. Because we've never heard one. So we've actually never had one go bad and it squirt out fluid like this from the overflow. So we think it might just be overfilled with transmission fluid. So we're going to keep a check on it. So he bought this one. <laughs> So anyway, he bought this one, the V6 one, to replace the four-cylinder. Nothing's wrong with the V6 one. It was a good car, but the valve cover gaskets were leaking, and he he had a, he had his nice wheels on this one. So we took those wheels were on this one. So we we so he wanted everything swapped from that one going on to this one. How is it driving, Barney? Realize how much faster it was. Yes. It'll go, won't it? You better not ever get rid of that car, but it smokes. Oh, it would do. Barely. No. No, it smokes, smokes, Jesse. It smokes. Listen, I got a little EF pacemaker that busts his ass every day. Is it like Skippy? No. No, it ain't nowhere near Actually, Skippy bad. So we took the wheels off that one and swapped them across. You get your ass in the seat. It's a video. I already made three today. Of what? Cars. I gotta, I gotta catch up on all our inventory sitting here. Yeah. Well, I need to go to Westgate. For what? I need to get me some, uh, what's that called? Freon. Why? <laughs> Freon. <laughs> Yo, Daddy Money. Why? Oh, he bought it for me? Two cans. Yes. Well, nobody told me because I ain't got no cash on me now. Why? No, I don't have any cash. Let's go. Woo! I don't have to get home, though. Where's Ronnie? So this one just needs valve covers now. No, J Chase did the valve covers on this one. $5. So this one's done. Um, speakers just got to get swapped. Radios got to get swapped. We already swapped the wheels for it. They got brand new tires on them. That one's got good tires too, but we're just taking everything off that one because I'm still not sure the transmission's bad. Could just be overfilled. We're going to check on that one and then we'll figure it out. That one's got to have all the belts replaced. So the water pump's bad, but we don't actually think it's bad because they called us back and said it was replaced about a year ago, so it shouldn't be leaking. They were like, why do you think it's leaking? And they brought it to us saying that it was leaking. So we told them, well, you're the ones that said it was leaking. So if that's not the problem, then, you know, I don't know what to say. So we're going to check the water pumps. If it's leaking, if it's not, then whatever. We're just going to send it on its way. It's done, pretty much, other than some new serpentine belts. 
But as of now, we've got that 626, that 626, this 626. And then the one eyed one horn fly up a paper leader. I said, that's Barney. Oh, that, that, they like it or something? Mm hmm.